This is today's Minnesota Real Estate Daily. I'm your host, Joe Metzler, along with special guest. Hi, Dave Harvey. Dave Harvey. Hey, are you a Pop-Tart? I like Pop-Tarts. Let's see, I like cinnamon and I like cherries and the sprinkle ones. I like those. <laughs> I'm not talking about those type of, type of Pop-Tarts. I'm talking about Pop-Tart real estate agents. I'm not quite familiar with that term. Well, Pop-Tart real estate agent, um, you know, that's one who pops for every potential buyer who calls you know, without doing their proper due diligence. You know, the second the buyer contacts you on the phone or email or whatever, you know, you drop everything, run out the door, uh, you know, to show them the home or, you know, whatever they want to see. And it's, that's a Pop-Tart. Isn't that what realtors do? Yes, but probably shouldn't be for a lot of them. You know, dropping everything to pop over to show a house when you already have plans or when you're not even sure if the client can buy a house, and especially with $4 gas, isn't really smart business. You know, no matter what the buyer tells you or how excited they are to look at a house. You know, I, I can't tell you how many times that I've gotten a pre-approval for a call from a client and they're out with an agent and they're running around, the agent calls me up and the agent has no idea you know, if they're approved, if, if there's any realistic chance whatsoever, if they can be approved. Now, was that for an hour, or for a day, or for a week, or a month? All of it. All of it. Now, you know, just because the client says they're already approved, they have a job, uh, they have good credit, or hey, they can even get a gift from mom for down payment, doesn't mean that they'll actually get approved for a loan. Every agent should mandate, and I mean mandate, that any first showing appointment is stipulated on that client connecting with a reputable loan officer and getting a current pre-approval. So current pre-approval, that's important. Is that what you're saying? <laughs> a current pre-approval really is important. You know, let's see. Uh, we talk to lots of people uh, all the time who says, you know, I, I was already pre-approved for a mortgage with so-and-so, you know, uh, a year ago. Well, you know, uh, it turns out, yeah, it was a year ago, and of course, we all know, you know, uh, the, the programs and how they've changed hundreds of times yeah. in the last year. So, you know what, I'm asking or really telling people, don't yeah. be a Pop-Tart, be a professional. You know, uh, set realistic expectations with your client, with your potential client. Let them know why pre-approval and that kind of stuff is very important, you know, how you work, you know. Uh, you know, and if they balk, it's probably that, you know, it's probably not somebody you want to work with. What are you doing? Well, I'm being a realtor. Free scenery. Yeah. You know, just kind of bring them along. You are you, are you, you a tour bus so operator? Yeah. Okay. Don't be a tour bus operator. You know, once you start jumping at every whim of some of these clients, especially in the beginning, you know, they're going to expect you to pop every single time. Now, don't get me wrong. If you've already got a valid pre-approval, you know, one that you know and trust from a, a reputable local loan officer, you know, and a brand new listing comes on the market uh, and, and the client wants you to pop and get over there and show it right away, hey, that's fine. There's no problem with that. You know, you already have a relationship with that client. So that's a little bit different. But to pop for someone you don't know, who just sent you an email, who just made the first phone call, you don't have a valid pre-approval, uh, maybe they're already working with another agent who didn't pop for them, you know, and someone who doesn't respect your time, um, for me, it's probably better to cut them off in the beginning. My name is Joe Metzler. This is Dave Harvey. This is the Minnesota Real Estate Daily. Thanks for watching. Go out and sell some homes. Have a good day.